So you guys, if you ever need uh, your house inspected for hail damage, first things first, when you get on the shingles after you've done a walk around, you wanna look for stuff, uh, impacts on the shingles. And what that is, is where a hailstone hit the shingle and it's knocked away the granules off of the shingle, exposing the matting. So we see some hail damage here, which I'll circle. Um, we have a very big impact right here as well. You can zoom in, you see how it's a lot darker than the, the places around it. Uh, more, I mean, it's all over here. The biggest thing that hail does in regards to damage on your roof, obviously this isn't gonna leak immediately. But what happens is over time, that'll get worse and worse and it releases more granules and it exposes this asphalt matting to the UV rays because the granules on your shingle are the protectant of the asphalt content uh, against the UV rays of the sun. So what happens is the asphalt in the shingles loses its viscosity and fails earlier than the original timeline of the roof. It'll lose all these, it'll blister out, and it, I mean, it's gonna look like crap, <laughs> obviously, and then also it has potential for leaks long-term. One of the big things, a misconception, is where the loss occurs. Yeah, it's not leaking. It might not leak, maybe ever, from this hail damage. I don't know. I've seen some pretty messed up roofs that aren't leaking. But where the loss occurs is this is a property that you invested in, and you invest a lot of money into it. Right now, when this roof is damaged like this, the value of this has decreased substantially. It's total. It has no value, actually, in the long-term life. It's lost parts of its life. So that's what you are insured for, is loss of value. Kind of like on a car, if it gets a dent, doesn't stop it from operating, uh, shutting the doors, running. That doesn't run, stop it from performing its duty, but it definitely loses value in your resale. So when you think about hail on a house and dents and impacts and stuff, don't think about the functional damage. Think about the potential for resale damage to your pocketbook. So this is Josh with North Face Construction here to answer your questions for storm damage. Uh, this is our segment of Ask a Roofer. Thanks for following and uh, subscribe to the link below and stay tuned for more informational episodes. Have a good day.